me, 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 me and my guys too groovy And we still get grungy, dreadlocks little oozy Ladies and gentlemen, your next match of the evening to be fought over three three minute rounds of amateur mixed martial arts rules in the welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, he enters the cage with a record of one victory, no defeats, representing FC PC. Please welcome Mason Hall. His opponent this evening standing across the cage, fighting out of the red corner, making his in cage debut, representing stronger MMA. Please welcome Ethan Charlton. Your referee in charge of the action, Mr. Dan Moverheady. Ethan Charleston from Stronger MMA in the red corner. And Hart looking to establish the clinch early, firing the knees close range. Double leg and drive straight back to Cage. The cage shakes as Hart puts Charlton up against it, looking for the takedown. And some nice hooks, early doors from Charlton. But I think it's clear Mason Hart's looking to get this to the floor. I see Martin Stapleton in the corner there. Of heart, extremely experienced campaigner, fought for a who's who of MMA. Hart now looking to work the single leg head inside at this point in time. He's going to look to maybe switch to the high crotch here up against the cage, but ultimately what he needs to do is run the, run the pipe down to his left, pop the head out, head outside, and bow on the leg to gain that takedown. Switch into the double here. Back to the single here. Beautiful work. Excellent. Anti grappling did being displayed by Ethan. Yeah, nice takedown defense from Ethan. Very composed for a debut. <laughs> Another all action fight here. Second amateur fight. Oh, he's ended up mounted here. Mason Hart. Charlton now looking to fire down with those punches. There was a sprawl that opened this position up in his head. Punches are getting through. The referee's looking on. Hart looking to get that guard position and scoot out the back door it's kind of like a reverse guard like a donkey guard what he's trying to do is get some leverage to pop his head out he's trying to pull his arms through the legs and escape out the back door and charlton's got to look to swim inside these legs pummel the hands on the inside and then push the shoulders through so he's back in the mount position yeah I like the way charlton's not panicking is he although yeah his man is out the back door now Wow, answering with some vicious hooks is Mason Hart. These two are going at it, Dean. Charlton now ducking the head. Ever so slightly to initiate a clinch, but he wants the separation here. He's got some good movement. He's got some elusive striking. Wow, what a fight this is. Beautiful left hook from Hart on the end of that combination. Hart now eating some body shots, but he's pressuring, looking for this takedown. But the key is the pummeling here. He's got to switch this position around. Big body shots return from Charlton. Yeah, often when this kind of clinch, you see the shots are almost just sort of scoring shots, but these are really going in from Charlton. Some sting on these. He's a little bit upright when he's backing out, though, Dean. He's been caught a couple of times by Hart backing out straight. The big knee there from Charlton. That, I think that hurt Hart. That's promoted him just to stay against the cage just to get his head back. Big head kick as well from Charlton. Wow, what a round of action from these two. I think overall in that round, you've got to say that Charlton probably caused the most damage doing that. I think there was a couple, as you mentioned, there was a knee in there. But Hart, super tough and super dangerous still. Landed some beautiful hooks of his own. Charlton going on the walk here. Hart storming forward. He briefly just touched Charlton there. But now he finds himself again with his back against the cage, powering through. It's just oh. the crisper boxing I'm seeing more yes. from Ethan Charlton. Absolutely, yeah. Mixing up as well. He's going to the body. Lovely mixing up now. He's really pouring it on now. Picking his punches. This is beautiful work from Charlton. Charlton coming in looking for that right hand. I like to see him mix up these head kicks. 
Well, the last one wobbled Hart. And Hart now just holding on, eating another cr crazy right hand. He's got massive chin, this guy. And again, followed wow. by the left. Wow, wow. Referee's having a close look at this one. There's no question here, Hart has got a massive heart, David. Hart is so, so tough, but he's shipping a lot of shots here. This is amateur level. I, I wouldn't mind seeing the referee step in between them, to be honest, Dean. Some big punches here. Hart's backing up. He's got to gain some distance between his opponent or clinch. The referee's looking on to finish this one. Pouring the pressure on is Ethan Charlton. He's looking for the headshots, looking for the jab. Look for the overhand right, but look at Hart, he's still going, digging deep, but it's all over, David. Fantastic work from Ethan Charlton. Not at, not one point, Dean, did he rush that. He picked his punches absolutely to the end. And for a guy making his amateur debut, I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if he has some sort of striking background, whether he's fought boxing or Thai or something, because the composure he showed in the closing stages of that was just absolutely fantastic. Credit to Mason Hart as well. Extremely tough individual, fantastic chin, and dangerous to himself. They both had moments in the first round. But wow, Ethan Charlton, when he was pouring it on at the end, just picking those shots, low kicks, body shots as well. I mean, how often do you see body shots in MMA at pro level, let alone an amateur debut? Just fantastic shot selection from Charlton. What a fight from both these guys, but what a prospect Ethan Charlton is. Ladies and gentlemen, at a time of one minute, 17 seconds of the second round, your winner by TKO in the red corner, Ethan Chelter.